only deal with fire, we passing on all the weak ish. Talk of pure culture, ain't none of that hype beast ish. Nah, this beginning to the end, no. Always keep it G, ain't nothing here for pretend, yo. Yeah, so you should want to lift your friends, know the God of the sneakers get blessed by Saint Hendo. I'm out. Woo, what's up, YouTube? Let's get it. This is. It's pretty exciting for me. I always wanted a pair of these, but I just got my first pair of Adapt BB version 2.0. These joints from 2020. Um, these are actually the NBA 2K20 joints. So that's the box. These are the 2K20 joints. For uh, I think if you did my player, you had to be on like the Lakers in order to get them or something like that. Uh, I don't know, but I just knew I had to have. Them. So especially like this specific colorway, like I knew I wanted it. I'm about colors. I love bright colors. I'm all about bright colors. I can't stress that enough. All right, so bright colors, gold, all that kind of stuff. So you know what I'm saying? Got the got a flip box. You know all right, so there's the sneakers right here. We'll get to them in a second. All right, so obviously you see that yellow joints anyway. You know what I'm saying? So all right, so what actually comes in here? All right, obviously you got the paper. You know what I'm saying? Nothing crazy about the paper. And then it is a charging pad. Some instructions, a book. Uh, it's been a long time. <laughs> I got instructions for a sneak. Uh, so you got the, the charger pad and all that. Then you have the. This is my first time actually opening these, bro. So, and then you have the cable to you know charge everything. So the cable and the block to plug in. So that's that. So I won't bore you with any more of the box, but it is a. There's no slide out or anything, but it's an actual hole right there. You know the old classic hole joint. It is just a flip up box. The only other dope thing I know is that it has that, that 2K20 logo right there. I, I thought that was a nice touch. All right, so let's push this off to the side. Right, my bad, let me throw this paper off there too. All right, so the sneaker itself, I haven't even tried these on, nothing. I haven't done anything with these. All right, so generally, I think it's dope. I like the way it feels. I really, really like, it's like on the back, on, like this stuff up here is like some type of engineered mesh or something like that this this front toe box area that whole four foot of the, of the shoe all right but the back is like this hard plastic and like a leathery maybe almost like a, a patent leather that's back here but it's like an iridescent patent leather that's on the tongue and on this rear portion and this back part is like a hard almost like a tpu plastic kind of thing um i just I like it. I'm with it. Super bright. You know, these are auto lacing joints. So it, it pairs up with the app and everything, which I haven't even tried yet. Um, so, uh, but I like, I really like how the Nike sign is. Okay, the swoosh. The swoosh is just, it's like speckled. It's like individual little dots that make up the swoosh. I thought that was a super cold idea too. So, also, that's the portion that you put on the charger. That has to be where the charger goes. Like, I know general information about this thing. Here's the buttons, you know what I'm saying? But you don't see too many yellow ones. I think I only saw like one or two yellow joints on uh, on YouTube. So this is how you, you know, turn them on and off, and all that kind of good stuff. Uh, another swoosh on the other side. See, this one is like plain Jane swoosh. That's on that side. So, mm, it ain't bad though, it ain't bad. So well, I definitely have to get them on feet so I can see how they feel. But I always wanted one of these, but I just didn't want to pay, you know, $700 for the first joints when they came out. They were like super hard to get your hands on. Not the, I ain't talking about the Air Mags. I'm just generally talking about the, uh, the what you call it, the Air Adapts, the first one. Uh, and I heard they weren't even comfortable, so I ain't even get them. Uh, but these ones, I knew I wanted these. I like the way they look. I really like the way these look. And uh, I don't know why, but I think the dumbest part about it is, to me, is why do they, ha they have a, a L on the left shoe and an R on the right shoe. Like, I, I, don't, I don't see I don't see why you would need that on a sneaker. But that's, I don't see the purpose. But to each their own, I guess, whatever. Ain't nothing I can do about it. But it's nice. I think the leather that's on the tongue, on this pull-up strap, I think that's the best leather on the whole sneaker. The best, that, that's, it's quality, you can tell by touching it. But I wish the, I wish that leather was on the, the rest of the sneaker back here. Or if they would've got rid of this little hook, that'd have been dope. I don't really care for that too much, but it is what it is. But I do like, I like the design of this. It's a really smooth design, really nice. Really nice. And um, right along the inside, right here on this portion, it says power lacing system. 
Then along the side, it has zoom on the front, zoom air. Uh, but then nothing, nothing else other than that sticks out. I mean, the main, the main eye-catching ordeal about this is the fact that they power these. That is it. That is the number one reason why people would buy this sneaker. Um, I bought it in a bright color. I want the red ones too, or um, the black ones, or maybe the Air Mag color, but we'll see how it goes. I got some adult responsibility to take care of before I can grab another pair of these. Cause these, you know, they ain't going for the low. I think, even on Nike, some of them are on sale for like 230 or something like that. That ain't bad. But you know, generally they like $400. So everybody ain't got that just throwing it around. So it is what it is. Um, but yeah, I definitely appreciate y'all checking it out. But I wanted to give you a little bird's eye view. Oh, other thing that was cool is it has the, the actual hard yellow inserts, like Jordan 11s and all that, just like that. Um, real solid, real sturdy, real sturdy piece of equipment right here. <laughs> yeah, so, no, it ain't bad. It ain't bad at all. They, they put a little, you know, I guess for $400, I mean, what'd you expect? You expect a little something. I mean, I, I expect more than this for $400, but it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? So, each day on. But I like them. I'll let y'all know when I rock them, like what they're going to be hitting for, how they feel. All right, but I appreciate y'all again. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, we'll do it again. Uh, I got more content coming. Let me know if you have anything you want to check out, you want to see. I got you. All right. So, I'll let you later. Yeah.